Boy, can't leave the kill without the drugs and the cap, boy If I win this connect, baby Yeah, that's on my back, boy Get ear to the max, boy Finny, that's a fact, boy I'm from a place where it's dark outside The late nights, you can't walk outside Bullets got the names on them Hit you when your homeboys ride As your mom shed a tears and she wondering why Uptown double H, man, this be the five MP in the cut, yeah, we get it live, Hey. Most just can't go to any hood, but it's connect shump could, baby shump hella good, baby. Okay, A5 MPY used to be uh-huh. Pay Street, we was right next to JB. Yeah. Hot box, not the Pontiac, till I couldn't see. And it's like that we live, man, it's full of sin. So we cope with the pain, bottle with a gin. Hey, New York brim, fresh corn, red Tim. Dice games on the corner, can't play if your pocket's slim. Hey, can't play, boy, never him. And don't play the game if you ain't trying to win. I'm just trying to catch my L's to 100 wins. Hey, big dubs, you feel me? Yeah. I'm just trying to catch my L's to 100 wins. Hey, big dubs, you feel me? Yeah. I'm just trying to tell my L's to 100 wins. 100 wins. Only time I'm gonna tell what it really what did. It did. I'm just trying to tell my L's to 100, 100 wins. wins. What's up, you guys? What's up? What's up? Good morning. Tiki says, what's up? You got the sun all in your little cute face. Just dropped off the baby. We are now going to get JJ. The substitute, not in the new, but she's just a substitute. So you got to you gotta behave for your teacher, remember? Because your teacher is not going to be there today, so you got a substitute. Oh, is that what she's going on the field trip? Oh, well, she didn't say all of that, but huh. She going on a field trip and she gonna leave y'all. What type of what type of mess is that? She should have. She should be in school, but she not. It's Friday and you know it's all Today's good. Ice cream day. Today is ice cream day after school. Yes, I'm glad you know. Um, I was gonna not even say nothing, but you know they get ice cream every Friday, um, after Friday. school with their grandma something nice for the kids after school especially if they did good all week long then that is my way of you know making sure that they get that's just my way of saying great job okay great job so yes friday is ice cream day okay listen it's getting nice out got me a cute little i don't care what nobody say it's a cute little seven dollar clearance outfit from walmart it came with this cute little tie-dye lightweight sweatshirt and i feel like it's a little bit too big because it's a size 16 but that's the only one i could find because i would it's an extra large i needed a large shirt but the extra large bottoms but um it was seven dollars versus 18 so look i'm gonna wear this around and be comfortable and we got these cute little gray biker short legging shorts go with it i don't really care who says from walmart you know, that'd be the problem with people sometimes. They they invest too much of their time in other people's lives, like straight up. They really do. The toxicity, the negativity, that'll get you after a while. And that don't be, it don't have me feeling in the right place. I just feel like, you know what? People be investing too much of their time in other people's lives. And you can't sit up here and keep judging a person, like, and talking about a person. Because what make you think that your life is so much better than anybody else's? You know what I'm saying? Like, move over and put your seatbelt on. Like, what make you think that your life is better than someone else's? And, like, I talk about a person. I don't care. I will talk about a person. Because who don't talk about people? People who talk about people all the time. And that's on a daily. You know what I mean? Hey, good morning. How's it going? Good, good, good. Goody, good, good, good. Goody, good, good. Goody, good, goody, good. So we got three each. Here's three for you. Put your hand out. And then we got three for you. Put your hand out. You got it? Ready? I'm going to drop it. 
Go for it. Drop it. Drop it. Drop it. Drop it. People, people talk about people. That's what people do. That's just human. That's just being a human being. You talk about people. But then when you start investing too much of your time talking about the same person or persons, it's like, you know what? I can't deal with this. And it starts to become really negative. Okay. Not only not even boring, because I don't even care about it being boring, but it does become negative after a while. And that starts to wear on a person. I don't know what it is today, but people need to learn how to drive, okay? Get your driving skills on, honey, and learn how to drive. Be cautious and be safe. I need you. I can okay, guys, can't play that for too long, okay, because they will demonetize me. But anyway, so I'm driving over here to Walmart where I used to um, frequent. I used to come to this Walmart all the time because my son was used to work at this Walmart. And even though it's a little bit away from my house, I haven't driven over here in a few months. And oh my God, all the stuff that they're building, like, and have built. I just like, came in here to see if they had this bun spray for the baby and stuff. Okay, I'm here looking for some more of those storage bin drawers. I went to Walmart and got these storage bins. You know, the storage, plastic storage bin drawers, the new, the nicer ones with the weave look. Well, let me tell you, I was, I got some on the fifth. And it was $28. Two days later, they put them down to $15. So, of course, I went back and I got um, my money back, like, you know, the $30 because I had bought two of them. So, I got my $30 back, but I just used it to buy two more of those. And um, I need a couple of more. Um, I'm not using them as dressers because um, they're, I mean, you can use them as dressers if you want to. That's up to you. You know, you do what you want to do. But I like to have a couple in my closet, okay? So that way I can store my wigs in them and they don't have to be getting all dusty from sitting on the mannequin heads for so long. But also, um, I'm going to put them in my garage so that way I can like store stuff in them in the garage and just make it look neater. Because I just hate, I just hate, I hate clutter. I hate mess. So I'm looking to see if I can find them here they had i got some yesterday but i wanted the brown one because i did use two of them for the dresser for um storage drawers for princess's clothes in the room because she had no she had no storage for all the clothes that she had so i figured they got the four tier bro four oh i want to scream they only have the four tier one. Oh, they got a great one though let me see something, guys. I'm talking about these. I can't right. find one in. The only brown one that they have is the four drawer one. And the four drawer one is like $50. These is ringing up $15. Um, I got my receipt in case they don't because you're going to store match it. But, um, yeah, we shall see. We shall see. <laughs> Getting the storage bins. You see the three storage drawers. Those are the weaved ones. Um, I ended up getting them. Those were the only two they had. But at that Walmart, they were the regular price, $28. But I did show them my receipt from the other Walmart. And, you know, they gave me my price match. So I like a good price match. So I got them for $15 each. I got, look, two for one deal, honey. So now I'm about to go into all these and get my dog some food and probably a couple of groceries. So you know what I noticed? <laughs> Everything is going up in price. Even the dog's food that she likes is going up in price. Okay, this was 49 cents. It is now 59 cents. So that went up in price. Like everything is going up in price. Make me want to cry, okay? That stuff be adding up. All these and everywhere else. For real. Like, oh my God. This will make you not want to go outside, like serious, and not spend your money on nothing. Like, you just spend your money on stuff that you really, really need, okay? And that's what I be trying to do. Like, I know I, well, I needed those storage bins. I got them for $15 a piece, so I needed them. I like coming to all these because we'll be having all kind of, like, specials and stuff. But I'm not thinking, I'm not, I, you know what? We got, like, so many groceries at home that we don't need anything, but I really did come here to get some stuff for Pancake because um, she needed some dog food. And if I buy the Little Caesars brand, it's like a dollar fifteen for one. So I'll drive all the way over here and get hers for um, 
60 cents, 59 cents now. But I'll buy enough to where I don't have to come back for like a few weeks or whatever. But they be having some like really cool stuff up in here. Um, for sale. It don't just be the food. Oh, I got to get Mumsy these ice creams that she wanted. She wanted these ice creams. Um, oh, I'll talk about her. Oh. Okay. Oh. My son, Jerron, loves these cereal bars. So I'll get a couple. Oh, at least they stay the same price, right? But he loves those. My older son. Look, I'll be trying to hook the kids up, okay? I'll get them all kind of stuff. Even if they don't even live in my house, I'm, I'm like, getting stuff for them. But he said he do like these ones. I be wanting to eat healthy all the time, y'all. Seriously, I do. But, I mean, I really, really do. But sometimes it's just like, okay, it's not that it's hard, but sometimes it just be like, okay, I just need to take a break, just chill. I, I, I want to eat this. I don't care what it tastes like. I don't really care what it do. I just want to eat this, and it's going to make me happy, so that's what I'm going to, I just want to eat this. Like fried pork chops. I love fried pork chops, okay? And I know it ain't good for me, but I just be on some shit where, well, I'm only going to live one time, so. But tonight I'm going to have some salmon. Oh, no, I don't think I'm going to have some salmon today because this little skimpy-ass salmon. Okay, you know what? I'll just go to Sam's Club. I have no room in my freezer for anything, okay? Nothing. So I'm not about to, and I have mad food in my house already. So I'm just going to leave now. Mumsy wants some type of ice cream things. And I'm going to get that for her. Then I'm going to be out. It's ice cream Friday. Yes, sir. Oh, for, for, for yeah, because why don't they have any sprinkles there? So when you buy it every Friday, you can bring it at the end of school. And I could just bring it. In, I could just leave it in my car because they have sprinkles in a little bottle. Mm -hmm. So that's a good idea. And they sell them at the Dollar Tree. So I have to remember when I go to the Dollar Tree this week to um, pick up some sprinkles. But the boys are enjoying ice cream right now. Is it is Friday? And every Friday they get ice cream. How about all the uh, the viewers can say you forgot the you should get you, you get the sprinkle so they can remind you. Oh, you want them yeah, to yeah the, the chat. You want them to remind me about mm -hmm. the sprinkles. Mm -hmm. yeah. For the boys, busting busting ice cream. I just love busting busting. Man, we ain't worried about spelling busting busting. Just enjoy that ice cream. You reward them ends of the week for a week well done you know gives them something to look forward to ice cream is fun i never get no ice cream i think i explained that to y'all before in the video i just like to see them have a good time and enjoy the ice cream i like to see them look forward to it so and they be remembering that it's ice cream friday <laughs> So we are at Desert Industries thrift store. So me, Mumsy, and Tinky came to this thrift store today, Desert Industries. Um, we've never been here, so we t we heard about it from the girls at Dee Dee's. And it is so nice in here. It's nice and organized, clean. It smells good. I am so excited about this. So we are about to look around. They have a yard area. Oh, my God, you guys, Desert Industries. Okay. That's for the TVs, boo. Oh, the TVs in here? Yeah. It smells so good in here. Big chair. Huh? Big chair. Oh, golfing. Golfing, yeah. <laughs> nice mirror. Ten dollars. Oh, they got a bunch of mirrors, huh? Ooh. It's a mirror? Yeah, that's a mirror. It is $8. You can go buy a brand new one at Walmart. You could buy a brand new one at Walmart for $5. That look, yep, yep. They're like 5 or 10 and they look way better. Hi. I want to miss a bike. Yeah, okay. You can want and want all you want. $10 for a rug. It is. It is. This is not bad. Hmm. She's like in this rug, guys. 
it's a nice smooth looking rug. You want a bed frame? No, I got a brand new bedroom set. What do I need a bed? <laughs> you know, because the guy that used to live with me, me and him went half and half on a bed frame. Girl, okay. Basically, I paid for it because he didn't really pay for nothing at my house. Um, $400 on the rent. So, girl, shoot. I earned that bedroom set. Okay. Yes. I, I'm going to get this because this looks really good. This looks really, really good. And it's not even used. Yes, it's coming home with me for ten dollars. Ten dollars? That's not that bad. Ten dollars. I really like this one right here. Look at that big one. Which one? That cubicle right there. The black one? Yeah. It's, it's like a dark brown. It's, it's oh. $15 and the small one's $15. But where am I going to put that at? At a time, I did want one, but I don't need it no more. I wish they had more than one of these because these are the real good ones versus the ones that I have in the bathroom. Oh, they do actually. And look at these, a dollar. This one, these ones are much better than the ones that I be buying from the Dollar Tree because these actually won't collapse. Why for too long? Never been married. Yeah. Engaged four times. Never worked. You've been engaged four times? Yeah, I went too fast. Oh. Was it with the same person or no, four different people? Different. Well, you might want to just stay single for a while, <laughs> Michael. No, nah, it's not mine. No. It's not me. Uh, they're, uh, well, that's what they all said. Yeah. They just wanted to use me for my money. Like, oh, okay. You know what? Well, you know what though? God will send you the right woman. Uh -huh. yeah. You gotta. You, sometimes you don't supposed to look though. My thing is, uh, just wanna hang out with people. I don't want anything serious. Well, then, but you know what? See, if you be more open to the people that come in the store, you hang out with the right people. That's and you want name. me to go on a date with you, but you no, tell no, me no. you want to hang out with us. As far as hanging out, it's different. Dating and hanging out are two different things. Okay. Dating is like a relationship kind of thing. You I just said, do I want to go on a relationship? Did I? <laughs> That's first. That's a first? Okay. That's first. Okay. Um, but no, I just, I don't want to take serious. I just want to hang out people. Will you find some friends? It's just not me. I'm too old to be a friend. Yeah. I, mean, I don't like friends. I don't need friends. Nah, I'm too busy. I'm too busy, but you know. Let me know though. Bye, right, Yeah, like Mumsy said, he's spitting game with every woman in here, okay? Just because we at the thrift store don't mean we need a thrifty ass, broke down man. So it seems like everything like is two dollars for the little kids. So I found this really cute dress for Navea and something else, two dollars. But the only thing I don't like about this store is these metal hangers because they just like keep sliding on the rack. I like the plastic ones just because it'll keep the clothes and steel in one spot. But other than that, it smells really good in here. It's very well organized. I got me a nice ass rug for ten dollars y'all hello and we're gonna go look at the other clothing um they don't have the clothes categorized by size but we will definitely um we will make our way around the entire store and see what we can find but yes old dude was trying to hit on me mumsy caught it all on tape and um then he tried to hit on the next girl like because i was not trying to give my phone number out or take his or go hang out with him or go on any day oh not everything is two dollars because oh this is a dollar but it's a little bit stained so i guess it all depends on the quality but um yeah he is making his way around the store and getting numbers yeah i know yeah whatever's got a little stain on it is a dollar this is cute for two dollars but this is very organized in here really cute you know, Mumsy went to look at stuff.
So we're done at the, what is it called? Savers? No, that is definitely not Savers. Can I have the lotion? Desert Industries with um something. We went there. I put the rug back. Decided I didn't need it and didn't want it. Um, the store is okay. Like, as far as, like, if you're looking for clothes to purchase, then, I don't know. It all depends on your taste. Me and Mumsy didn't find anything. But they did have a couple of cute things for um, Princess. And that was about it. Like, um, I felt like everything was kind of, like, um, outdated. And maybe not even outdated, but outdated, but also, like, elderly looking. So, you know, I mean, it was a nice trip and a nice experience. It's very well organized and neat and everything very well organized and stuff like that. But like for me to drive over here, 20 minutes, 24 minutes, I wouldn't do it. I would come if I was in the area of the mall. Other than that, I'm not driving all the way over here for this, for this thrift store. Like no harm intended, but, and the guy was a creep in there. Michael, he was definitely a creep. He hit on me, some other girl, and some other girls. It's like, and then he was talking to some dude about, you know, he wanted to hang out and make friends. Like it was, he was, he became a creep. Okay. And we don't do creepish, like, he, like, I already knew he was on some type of drugs or off drugs. So, cause I did ask him that, um, like, what, what do you do? What have, what have you done in your life? That's what I asked him. I was like, was you a criminal? Did you do any crimes, drugs, you know, or did you took drugs, alcohol? He, he was like, he'd been clean for like, what did he say, Mumsy? I don't even remember. Like six months or something like that. Like, dude, you are too desperate to want to be with somebody and leave me. I, I was just really trying to be nice to him because I know me. I'll come off as really not mean, but like direct and blunt. And I'm trying to get out of that habit as being like so like blunt to people. But I guess, you know, you, you do have to be blunt to some people still because they don't get the point. Because he did keep coming back asking me, you sure? You don't want my number? If you change your mind, like, dude, leave me alone. And I didn't really want to be mean to him because he also had a handicap, you know? He wasn't able to walk, like, you know, regular. So I didn't want to be mean to him because of that. But shit, in a minute, I was about to. After he kept coming back asking me, well, if you change your mind, like, do I look desperate and lonely to you? You know? But anyway, I mean, it was a nice experience to come and, and check the place out. But yeah, it's definitely not for me, this place. Um, they did have some nice things in there, like far as like if you need furniture and stuff. But I don't need furniture, so I'm good with that too. And I definitely don't need like outdated clothes, so I'm definitely good with that too. But we, we, we had a good time. Now we're going to go to Nate's job, Aerie. And we're not going to buy none. We're just going to say hi because... It's on the way home. What's up, you guys? Good morning. Good morning. There's Tinky in the back saying good morning. So today is physical therapy for Potato Princess. She has to go like once a month just to see if she is uh, basically on the level she needs to be with like her motor skills you know touching for toys grabbing things like that so this morning i decided to get up and wear my own hair out you know i just took the two cornrows out and just do a headband on it but i don't know how i like it if i like it enough i don't know for some reason maybe it's the eyebrows maybe i shouldn't have did my eyebrows because i have no makeup on you know how you just don't never be satisfied not it'll never be but you know how you just I guess you just are the person you're you are your most judging person like you judge yourself the most and I don't know I just am not feeling this whole entire hairstyle but I did start my fast and last night's dinner was so delicioso so good like Tinky would say it was bussing bussing right steak and rice. we didn't have steak oh you had steak too yeah. Oh, I don't have steak. I had um salmon, asparagus, and Tinky had you have salmon? No. Tinky Tinky had salmon, steak, and rice. Um his mother made us dinner and that salmon was so it was just so succulent. Oh my god. I had to have a second second go round of the salmon. So I had salmon and asparagus and that's a healthy meal. Oh, she gave you some of her steak that she made? 
Yeah, it was it was it was busting busting like the kids say. Okay, you guys. So, uh, just went in Dunkin' Donuts, my favorite place. That staff is so sweet. So I found out that all of the people that work there, all of the staff that I, you know, speak with, talk with, they are all 17 and 16 years old. So they do homeschooling online. So that's the reason why they get to work, you know, at Dunkin' Donuts throughout the day. But the one thing that is like disturbing to me is the fact that the night crew, I don't know who the night crew is, but the night crew is the same age group. They need like an adult manager, supervisor on board because the way the night shift leaves the store is disgusting. And then here it is, these young people that work during the daytime, the ones that I always come in and chit chat with, they're left to hold all the blame. And it sucks when you have a corporation that is making all this money but can't make the right decisions. You know what I mean? And then when your store falls apart, you wonder why. There is the adult that runs the store, the adult manager, the adult supervisor at night. They're like, there isn't one. There's no adult. They're all 16. That's why the store gets left like that. Listen, Dunkin' Donuts, you know I love y'all, but y'all need to get it together at some of these locations and stop leaving children to be responsible for certain things. Mm -hmm. out again um i didn't realize it was 10 07 when i finished cleaning i was cleaning the house washing the dishes you know just straightening up i don't like to leave my house a mess then i realized oh snap i gotta leave potato got an appointment at 10 15. thank goodness it's like right down the street Princess to a therapy appointment, pediatric therapy. Okay, this is the first visit. So I'm not really sure what they're gonna do, but we shall see. Oh, she's following it. That she's following it. Yes. Okay. She had these rattles, these rattles for her wrists that we put on her. Okay. What am I? Such a happy baby. <laughs> oh my goodness. You have to get so many fussy. <laughs> yeah. Get on the mat. Yeah, we're gonna get out. Okay. She's gonna so she's gonna do tummy time down there. Real quick. Yeah, I'm gonna do tummy time. It's like a foundational skill and it'll help with all the little milestones because it'll help strengthen through her back. Oh, there he goes. So strong. I never knew that. Oh. Wow. <laughs> Question. I guess it's been a while. When do they um, start sitting up? I, I I can't remember. Um, sitting up should be like four to six months. Oh, say, yeah. not fully. And just start. Huh? Yeah. So 
with support. Um, okay. And then tummy time will help with that too because oh. it's strengthening all those muscles and helping with that. Yeah. Um, that's why, like, when I learned in school, my professor was saying, like, you should prioritize tummy time over anything okay. just because it's so foundational for them. It can help with even, like, handwriting in the future. Really? So being able to sit up right yeah. to, to write. Um, I've never been told that with all my kids. Never. I know. I feel like they don't say anything. It always you changes can, something, right? I know. And you can start it from the day they come home from the hospital. Yeah. So I went home and made a quick outfit change so that we could go to the mall. Me, Nate, and um, the baby, Potato. We're going to Desert Sky Mall to Burlington so I can find me a car mount. I'm not gonna buy anything but what I need, which is a car mount. That's it, that's all I'm getting, it's a car mount. I don't want anything else. I brushed my hair up in a bun because I felt like it made me look fat with it out. I just didn't like how it looked out. And I changed the whole outfit. It was more of less of a lounging outfit. You know, I'm trying to take away from the wideness of my face. So we're going to go home now. Got a new phone mount. Thought I would share that with you guys, you know? Yes, got a new phone mount. Are you eat my candies? Yeah. Oh, that's okay. Yes, you guys, check it out. Premiere at Walmart. Wally Walls. Folds up for unblocking view when not in use. Hello. We'll see how that works out. <laughs>